YouTube, what's good? What's good, man? It be your boy, East Coast Kicks. 856, man. Straight from Jersey, man. Y'all already know how we do. You know how we get it in. Uh, the Retro Ones. This is my very, very first one. I'm going to be honest with you. When I was getting J's and whatever, when I was younger and all that, the last time I really probably got a retro one was like, I don't think I, eh, I, don't, I don't think I can remember that. I was maybe like one or two years old. My dad and them got it for me around like 80, like 84, 85 or something like that. Yeah, right? maybe, maybe 86. I'm not sure. I couldn't even remember that because I was a kid. I just seen pictures and everything. I wish I could find it, but it is what it is. But before we get into it, like, subscribe, comment, tell me what it is, what you need and want to know about this shoe or et cetera, et cetera. Let me know, man. I'd be gladly to help you out, man. So like I said, like, subscribe. Also, look up on my um, IG page, which is East Coast Kids 856, and Twitter as well. I'm on there too. So, um, I just mainly, I don't really, really use Twitter like that. I just usually be getting on there and just see what's the new, new, like from Yeezy Mafia, Jays, and any little hottest things that I like to snag up on. Folks like to snag on up and I like to, you know, cop as a reseller and all business. I wish I was down at Sneaker Con in Dallas, but. You know, funds was kind of low and I had some things that I had to do. So, I mean, you feel me, you feel me? But like I said, I'm trying to get, I'm going to get that camera like my man said. Yo, I'm going to get that camera so we can get a better view. And like I said, I'm still renovating the room and everything. I've been switching things around, like I said, between work and all that. It's been getting hectic, man. So, uh, let's get into these retros, man. The retros Gym 1, man. My very first pairs of these, yo. I actually like them now. I like them. I'm, I'm gonna be real with you. I like them. So, uh, let's get into it, man. Uh, as you can see, it comes in your OG, original box, black, red, you know, the same old, same old. Like I said, this is my first retro one ever in my closet <laughs> with all the other stuff that I always loved and liked my very first one and um retro gym was size 9 US size 9 and the colorway on here is the Air Jordan retro 1 high OG black gym red white seal Right here, see that? Yup, size nine. Yeah, I got like I said, I got a little fit. Yeah, man, let's get up into this shoe, dog. Oh, like it's a lot that I want to say about this shoe, yo. Like looking at the um. What was it? The last one that was, I think it was a few months ago that just came that it came out not too long ago. The um not the Photoshops, the uh, no photo no no photo. The um uh, it, 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 it's, it's gonna bug me now. No, I got it. The retro one, not for sale. If you notice, it's just like the retro one is not for sale, but the only difference about it was about that shoe and this shoe. I wish I was able to get that shoe and do a comparison, but I'm just gonna go off of the photos that I've seen and the person that I have seen on one and feats like that. So if you notice, the other one was all, pretty much all, the whole material and everything was the same, but this part right here was red, pretty much. It, I mean, no, not red. This part right here on this one is red. The other one is all black. And the seal is still the same, but the bottom of it, the bottom was red, if I'm correct. I believe it was red. I might have to look at it again, but I think, I think I'm think i right, it's, it's, it's red. But 
For this to be my first retro wand, I'm gonna be honest with you, I actually like this shoe. Perfect on my feet. So I recommend you guys, if you got it already today, like I, I had one on, I hit a lot. All I got today was a very, very good day. I hit a lot on them raffles today, man. So, Jesus, man, I had about like good six, seven of them, man. So yeah, so resale. It was good, man. The resale was good, man. But and on to this shoe, still the same as your not for sale shoe. So I don't think I really. I'm not gonna explain really too much about this though. Now a lot of people are complaining about the leather though, and I don't really. It's it's real shiny. The leather on here is real tough. It's like a stronger leather type jacket type though but it is it, very nice looking i like it goes along with the hat and the shorts that i had just gotten out too long ago off the coupons you know? so yeah good shout out to foot locker foot locker foot action and champs and all that because <laughs> y'all y'all really loaded me up with some coupons boy sheesh thank you what this comes with a nike regular regular um og1 nike one uh Nike logo up here on the top of the top. Now, the leather on here, on this, if you're gonna get this shoe, I recommend you to go true to size. Straight true to size. Don't get no um, half size or smaller size. Go to your natural size. So if you wear an eight, stick with an eight. If you wear an eight and a half, eight and a half. If you wear a nine, nine and a half, and so on and so on. So yeah, yo, like, I like, I, I really like this shoe. Now. <coughs> if y'all got this shoe it definitely does have a strong glue smell to it so yeah so y'all you can, you can smell it the moment you open up this box man so you got your extra red laces right here it comes with a your factory stock all black laces but you see this leather right here I mean not the leather you, you see this right here I like this. I, I I love the texture of it. I love the feeling of it. And this leather ain't bad, you know. It's, it's really not bad. The white the, the white seal the uh white seal right here. You know what? I'm digging it. Like you might as well say, instead of saying white seal, you might as well just call it an off white because that's exactly what it is. It's just it's just off white. But people want to get a little fancy name to it, so it is what it is, man. So. Yes, and right here you got your Jair Jordan little shoe case drawn that you put in here. I save these a lot. I save these because when I put them back in the box and everything, I don't want them to crease at all. So I save these a lot. Like when I say I save these entirely a lot, I save these entirely a lot. And what else? Size nine, regular shoe string, Air Nike. If you can see it, I'm gonna try to press it lighting. Not too great. There you go. There you go. Air Nike in the bottom on the inside of the sole. You also got Nike right here on the bottom. And that's pretty much it for this shoe. Like it's pretty much exact. It's, it's like I said, if you already have the um, oh my god, my, my train of thought is just like uh right now because I've been I've been up early all day running with getting this parachute, that parachute, that parachute, dropping them all, picking up the bread, and etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. So yeah, so I've been all over today drop dropping shoes off left and right, man. But it was all good because man. As you know, I got, I had to get a pair, man. I got to get my own personal pair. It wouldn't be right to have a whole bunch of collection of shoes, of Jordans and everything and whatnot, and Yeezys, and you don't have the original first pair, though. That's that's crazy, yo. Like, trust me, a lot of people were shaking their head at me. They said, what? You ain't got a pair of retro, uh, retro ones? The very first one that came out? I said, no, like, I, I, I didn't like it at first, but then as a while, it grew on to me, so... 
And I mean, as a sneaker collector and a reseller, I was like, you gotta have, you gotta have that pair in your um, in your closet, man. You got to. So I'm gonna be probably done for a hot minute or whatever and whatnot. Stay on shorts, just pull it down, man. Jesus, man. Ugh, crazy. But um. Like, subscribe, man. Shout out, give me, give, give me a comment, man. Follow the kid. Matter of fact, I'm gonna put my link on down here. You can go ahead and follow me on um, IG, man. It'll be East Coast Kicks 856. That is all in one word. And at the end of Kicks, it's not an S, it's a Z back. It's a Z on there. So, yes, East Coast Kicks. So, yeah, man. So, uh, I wish I want to, I want to do on feet so bad right now. Like, ah, I ain't got that type of good camera like I normally would, but it's all gravy, man. Like I said, like, subscribe, holla at your boy, man. Oh, yeah. I go get a picture too, you know. City of flight, baby. You feel me? Peace.